How's it going everybody? Welcome back to another episode of It's All Relative. Today we are going to be doing Community Day finally. It's been a while since we had a Community Day. Uh, yeah, it's Abra. As you can see, we already have an Abra just in front of us. If it's a shiny, I'll be, I'll be freaked out, you know, but it's not. So, I was actually a bit curious. Since you know Abra can like flee easily and stuff, if you do not actually catch your shiny Abra on your first ball, does it, fl does it flee or something? I'm not sure. If you guys encounter that, let me know if the first ball doesn't actually catch the Pokemon. I'm kind of curious, you know. Anyway, so we already caught our first Abra for the day. We're going to be looking for a shiny for the next six hours or something like that. Um, here's what we're going to do first, okay? In the shop, there's actually like a, I say, a special event where you can actually buy uh, a ticket and stuff for that for this Abra community day and stuff. So we're going to do that right now. Okay, we just bought it. Nice. Alright, so I'm not too sure what exactly what this ticket actually provides or something like that. So we're going to find out right now because for the next six hours, I'm pretty sure there's going to be like some additional stuff that we can do. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so you earn a medal, uh, which is basically for today. <laughs> ah, there we go. Okay, so the research is here. Good to see you again, Ivy Huxy. Have you noticed the increased number of Abra in the area? Not really. So did I originally thought that this strange phenomenon was happening due to Abra's ability to teleport? And when Abra decided to teleport randomly, it creates an illusion that it made a copies of itself. Ooh. Um, well, you know, I'm not going to read the whole thing, but basically, we have a new quest to do. Alright, so first chapter is power up Pokemon 10 times, catch 10 Abras and make 5 nice throws. Eh, simple enough. So, uh, Pokemon we're going to power up 10 times, here we go. Uh, to be honest, I'm not too sure what to power up, uh, but since I'm doing Melmetal, a lot of Melmetal in my Master League and stuff, and I actually haven't max, uh, how you say, maxed this out yet, let's max out this guy 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 so 68,000 Stardust, 76 Candy just enough candy I assume uh, yeah we're not gonna max him out because obviously I'm still like trying to save and I don't have enough candy and stuff that you see cool we can claim the Pokeballs because we actually need Pokeballs for this well what just happened Okay, anyway, uh, yeah, we're going to be putting an incense because obviously the place that I'm at don't respawn really a lot of Pokemon So we're going to put an incense, we're going to try to catch as many Abra as we can for the next 6 hours and hopefully we can get something great Well, that didn't take very long. Okay, on our third hour of today, we found a shiny already, 934 CP. So I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna see that if I do not catch it on the first ball, does it teleport away? Like, so we're, so we're just gonna like do a throw. Oh man, I got a great shot. I didn't want to do a great because I want to see that if the shiny can actually run away. Please come up. Please come up. Oh, damn it. Okay, we're gonna experiment this. We're gonna try and see that if we can get actually get the Abra to pop up from the first ball, and then see that it does it run away on the you know after the first throw. But yeah, we got our first shiny, so that's kind of cool and stuff like that, so god. Okay, so that's one down. Uh, we still have like six, <laughs> five and a half hours to go. So yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna be a while. Alright, we just need one more Abra to complete the first chapter. Hold on, let's check some Abras first. Second one. Bam! Not a shiny, okay. But here we go. First chapter is completed. Uh, I'm still looking for a good Abra that we can use for Great League or something. Uh, I don't know, we'll find out. Okay, so here we go. 20 candies, obviously. And then I don't know what's this. Is it Abra? Yes, an Abra. <laughs> so, Abra quest give you Abra reward. Kind of makes sense. Alright, so we get 2000 Stardust, uh, 1 Incense, and a Pokemon appear. I assume that Pokemon appear. Please don't be an Abra. I swear to god, there will be too many Abra. Oh my god, it's an Abra. <laughs> they're not joking when they're really going to give you as many Abra as possible. To find a shiny, you know? Fantastic work, are you having difficulty catching Abra you encounter? It said that you must clear your mind if you want to catch an Abra or maybe you could ask your buddy for some ass catch assistance. I got some few things about Abra that I could help you research. How about you give me a hand if I see that I can find a nice trick for your buddy. Okay. So let's see. Oh, we can get a Poffin for this chapter. That's kind of nice. So catch 15 Abra, transfer 10 Pokemon, evolve 3 Abras. Wow, three evolve 3 Abras. Okay, so uh, I guess we're going to be catching and evolving them. The thing is right now, incense is actually giving, one incense is actually going to give you three hours of duration, so that's kind of nice. Uh, so make sure you use your uh, in Stardust as well, they're giving ridiculous amount of uh, uh, Stardust, as you can see, three times plus uh, Stardust is like 4.5 times, that's crazy man. So anyway, we're going to transfer 10 Pokemon, we will catch, transfer, catch, transfer, and we're going to evolve three Abras along the way. Yeah, chapter two sounds quite
that was bound to happen. We have our second shiny here. Whoa, 908 CP. Well, I, I think it's quite good that the CP is actually quite high. Don't have to really power up, waste uh, stardust and stuff. So, yeah, second shiny of the day. Uh, still in chapter 2. Uh, we are still, you know, it's still within the first hour. So, to be honest, I'm not sure if I'm going to be playing for the 6 hours. Uh, if I do, I'm not sure how many shinies I can get. Probably more than I expected. Oh, this is actually quite good. I can actually use this. Oh, more Abras. No. Okay, uh, how about this? Let's do one evolution just to get it out of the way uh, because yeah, we gotta get to a Kadabra to finish one of the quests. Involve this Abra here. 16 CP. That is really low. Alright, uh, for the time being, I'm gonna keep all the Kadabra because I don't know if the next few chapters I will require to evolve a Kadabra to an Alakazam or something. You know what I mean? So yeah, just keep the Kadabra first. Uh, we'll figure out later on. Maybe there'll be one that says evolve one Kadabra to Alakazam most likely. So, okay, so cool. We completed three. All right, so how many left? We need to catch two more Abras and transfer two more Pokemon. All right, last Abra. <laughs> well, obviously the last Abra is gonna be a shiny, so that's kind of good. Okay, wait, hold on. I've been talking about this just now, so we're just kind of we're gonna try to catch it in a way that it will flee. You know, like I don't know, break out the ball first, and then see if we flee. It doesn't break up. So we already caught three shiny Abras and that will complete our 15 uh, Abras catch. That's kind of nice. All right, ooh, another Abra, wow. A lot of Abras are popping up, guys. This is quite good. So we're done with chapter two. Let's claim our 20 candies. Uh, Abra, I assume. Ooh, it's a Kadabra, nice. Lily pop. Claim another 1,000 this thing. 2,000 Stardust, one Incense, and one Puffin. So this will be the first time I ever uh, obtained a Puffin. So that's kind of nice. So I'm pretty sure your buddy appreciate the delicious puffin. I'm more than a pineapple berry myself. While research researching Abra, I read that it can sense danger and maintain a telepathic uh, radar even while it's sleeping. Uh, what amazing ability. Why don't you keep researching as a token on my tank? I'll give you one of rocket radar I developed. Whoa. Make three great curveball throws. Okay, evolve one Kadabra. Obviously, that is what I was talking about. Transfer 10 Pokemon. So that's really simple actually. And we already have... Okay, so we are almost done with this chapter. Uh, I only need to evolve one Kadabra. So the thing is right now, all the Kadabra we have right now is kind of crap. Uh, but what we're going to do is maybe we're going to evolve one of the shiny ones first. Uh, you know, just to get it out of the way. Uh, so, let's see. This shiny is not that great. Uh, wh which shiny was the good one? Ah, this is the good one. Okay, so we're just going to evolve this guy to Kadabra. Then we're going to evolve it to Alakazam. By the way, if it's a bit noisy, that's because I'm kind of at the balcony right now, you know, I didn't want to stay in the room the whole time. And you guys can actually hear choppers around because apparently in Singapore there's going to be choppers moving back and forth a lot. I don't know why, military choppers here and there. So here we go, shiny Kadabra, first time ever. Wow, that looks nice. I kind of actually like the light color-ish, but okay, it doesn't matter. Pink color Alakazam with uh, counter, bam, there it is. Shiny Alakazam, guys. It's nice. Alright, so we evolved our Kadabra already. Uh, is this a shiny? No, it's not. 20 candies. Uh, what's this? And then, uh, yeah, raspberry. Cool. Alright, 2000 Stardust, 1 Incense, and Rocket Radar. Thank you again for all your help. Uh, we learned so much about this psychic type Pokemon. Okay, uh, truly amazing. There's something blah blah blah. Until next time. So I assume the last chapter is just free stuff. Yeah, so 5,000 free Stardust, uh, 1.5k EXP, and 5 Silver Pineapple Berries. And yeah, 2,000 uh, Stardust, 3 Rare Candies, and uh, last Pokemon should be an Abra as well. Abra. Oh wait, no, it's an Alakazam! I wonder if it's possible that it can be a shiny Alakazam. Let me know if any of you guys actually got a shiny Alakazam from that. But yeah, uh, because of this, we're going to straight use uh, Pineapple Berry because obviously catching a third stage Pokemon, you know, it's going to give you a lot of Stardust, it's going to give you a lot of candy, I'm trying to save up as much Ultra Ball as possible. And yes, thank God. Okay, it's 12 o'clock and it only took us less than one hour to complete the entire thing. Uh, 2,000 star Whoa, this is actually not bad. I'll keep it. And he has counter as well, so you would definitely get an Alakazam with counter uh, if you do not plan to like, I say, evolve or anything. If you just need to do the quest, you'll get Alakazam no matter what. So for the rest of the 5 hours, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to be chilling out of the house. Uh, I'm going to play some PS4, I still haven't finished my game control. We're going to be catching a, a couple of Abras, have some lunch. Now basically just 
chill out for the rest of the days because the rest of the time is just catching abras and relax. So let's just do that. Well, I think I broke the game because quite frankly, whenever I put on new like uh, star dust, sorry, star piece and stuff, it keeps stacking on the side. I'm not sure you guys saw one of the clip I put, but here it is. I'm going to show you guys. This is a bit weird and we're already up at 2 p.m. right now, so it's already three, uh, halfway through the community day. As you can see, the side is like 0, 0, 0, 0, and then there's one is negative 1 and negative 12. Like, I don't understand what's going on. <laughs> I think after this uh, star piece, right, I'm going to put another one. I'm going to see if it's going to stack below the, uh, how you say, wherever there is, the interface is there. Maybe it will break and keep going down. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but I think I do know that it's, if I restart the game and stuff, it will clear. But for the time being, you know, you don't really see this a lot, right? We're going to keep stacking it and see what happens. And the incense is going to be completed in about 13 minutes, so maybe... I don't know, maybe in 13 minutes we will put another incense and then it will stack again? I don't know, this is this is very weird. But uh, let's recap on the shinies we have so far. So, so far I already have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 6 in 3 hours, uh, although they're all from incense, so yeah. Uh, one of them is actually quite good uh, IV. Let me see, which one was it? There was one that was like, oh yeah, this one is really good. Like this is 0, 15, 15 for like Great League, this is amazing. Um, yeah, this is a shiny, this is a almost 91% I think 89 I, I don't know but this is 15 attack so yeah so far not bad six shinies uh, wasn't really hunting too hard and stuff I just wanted to see how many shinies I can get within the first three hours so for the next six uh, next three hours I'm just gonna chill out and stuff like that I'm not gonna play too hard but uh, you know if I can get extra shiny I will all right here's what we're gonna do we're gonna put that incense right now let's see what happens all right here we go Oh look, it actually stacked down there. Can you guys see? It stacked below the overlay. Oh my god, so with that said, it's gonna keep like stacking all the way to the bottom. Way past this point. So once we're done with this, uh, this one here, it's gonna stack below it, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Okay, this is really getting out of hand. You guys can see the side of my screen. Literally all of that. Wow, what's going on? Like this bug is crazy. Hold on, let me check this Abra first real quick. Oh wait, no, Abra turned to a trico, sure. Alright, so I think I'm gonna end the episode here because no one I already caught 10 shinies. Uh, I'm not sure if I actually showed them all on screen, but yeah, there's 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So yes, 10 shiny abras. Obviously I could catch more for the next two more hours to go or is it one and a half yeah but you know I don't really need that many shiny abras to like fill up my Pokemon uh, storage so yeah I think I'm just gonna leave it at that anyway I'm gonna evolve some uh, Kadabras to Alakazam in off screen because uh, well you know I need some Alakazam with uh, counter but in the meantime hope you guys enjoyed this episode um, before I go I do want to check something hold on, hold on. there's a our boach I want to try if I close the game and I turn it back on again will the side stuff disappear or something. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this bug is going to stick around forever or something like that. And it's... Ah! It got clear! So, I guess in a way the bug only stayed if you do not restart the game or something like that. So, yeah, it's kind of a funny bug but, you know, it was like basically stacking all the way to the past the bottom of the screen or something like that. So, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know how many shiny uh, Abra do you manage to catch. Did you play the entire six hours? Uh, if you do, Congrats, you know, that's determination right there. Anyway, I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys.